Guys, today I'm here today and I want to show you my Pokemon card collection that I got from someone as a gift. I mean, before I had a bad card collection and they wanted to give me a stronger one because they noticed how I was bad. So, that was generous. I mean, I've been doing a lot better now with it and I think it's pretty cool. I mean, it's not an easy game either. So, I'm going to go by one, show you the cards I have, and then I'm going to review them by how much I have and how many of each category I have. So you can see all I have right now as I go down. And it's pretty, well, I have some cover packs for it, and I'll definitely show you those too. And a lot of this stuff is very useful. So it's kind of like a deck that gets me some wins when you use them right so let's get to it right now and here we got the ultra ball thing and discard two from your hand search your deck for a pokemon reveal it and put it in your hand afterwards so yeah it's pretty you gotta sacrifice two cards to use it but pretty much comes in handy and i have four of them some are different picture for some reason but who knows all right and here i got carpador and he i can use him to evolve trubbish and get some better moves so it's a pretty cool moves to use actually and pretty useful i have like a bunch of them uh, i'll say about five and Pretty comes in handy. I have them, but. And we have uh, Sophocles, where if you discard two from your hand, if you do, you can draw four cards. Like, say there's two there not helping you out, so. Comes pretty much in handy. And here's the. Uh, Field blower, choose up to two any combination of tool cars and stadium cards in play. It's kind of hard. I don't really know what these do too much, but I barely use them. So I'd be all right with discarding them. I might have to find something to replace them to make it better. So this is everything I have by columns of, since I have a lot of the same of each card. But first I'm going to start here with Trubbish. You know who Trubbish is. It's got some moves that you can use and have energies to use them. I have about four of Trubbish, but it's easier to show off by one, so I have to show one by one. And here I have um, uh, Hala. It's a trainer card. Shuffle your hand into your deck. If you used your GX attack, draw seven cards. If not, you can draw. You have to draw four, so comes pretty in handy if you ask me. And here is a bunch of my uh, energies for, um, we'll just say purplish. It's hard to identify them sometimes, you know. So I got about uh, nine of them, and here I got some how you cards. If you draw it, you get to use it and draw about three cards, and it comes pretty in handy sometimes. And here we got the choice band. I have about four of these. So these are a little hard to use sometimes, but depends on the situation. But you get to do like 30 more to your opponent's Pokemon or any kind of. You just got to attach it to each one and and here I got some energies and about four each are double and it's pretty in handy like these are like really hard to get I hear so that's how mm, that's how it gets they really come in handy all right so then we have here is um Bodybuilding dumbbells, at dumbbells or whatever the hell you call it. It adds health to your Pokemon, and I think even when you're full, 
you're still at your full health, you can use these. So they're pretty handy too. And we have here is Guzma from Team Skull. And uh, search one of your opponent's bench Pokemon with their active. If you do, you switch your active Pokemon with your benched. They're pretty hard sometimes. One time I had energies in my bench and they switched it just to take me the one I had energies out. So a lot of ridiculous rules to this game. But um, we also have the Rescue Stretcher. And uh, if you, you could choose one of the two. First one is put a Pokemon from your discard pile in your hand. Or the other is shuffle three Pokemon from your discard pile into your deck. So that you can use them again. And here I have Phantom. And uh, he's pretty useful. Your opponent's active Pokemon can get confused. And really I have a bunch of them. Really just a couple actually. And we have here is Trevenant. Um, when you evolve them from Phantom, you get these other cool moves, and I think these are pretty good. I mean, they're really come in handy, and it helps you with certain situations, but when you strategize a little, you can use them wisely. Um, we have an Enhanced Hammer, and these ones, um, can only discard special energies. They can't take away hand energies that you have currently and sorry about the noise in the background but uh it's really useful but it's kind of hard when sometimes they don't have special energies but um here we have the three altar of the moon stadiums and i think psychic and dark you can use them for but when you have those energies attached to certain pokemon but the chances of me always doing that, just a risk to have this. I kind of think I might replace these a little and save them for when I really need them. But that's for now. And I have the last five cards. And uh, each of them don't have any columns to go with. I only have one of each. So I have Professor Kukui. If I draw two cards, then I can also add 20 damage to my opponent's to my attack when I use an attack on my turn. Escape Rope. Um, each player switches their active Pokemon with one of their benched and switches first. If your opponent switches first, if a player does not have a bench Pokemon, then the player doesn't switch Pokemon. So there's certain times you want to use them. And we have um, Exorola. Put one of your Pokemon that has any damage counters on it and all cards switch to it into your hand pretty useful and we have uh liama whatever um each player shuffles their hand into their deck and flip a coin if heads then the player draws six cards if tails they draw three so it's kind of a change up put a supporter card from your discard into your hand and that's really all there is to it that's my collection yeah, so that's pretty much it I have for today. I promised I'd show you my cover of the cards. Each one has these. Um, I don't know if you can quite see it, but... Yeah, it was really generous when this guy gave me this deck. He said it'd get me some wins, but... Still add trouble. And I'll eventually get more wins, and... You just gotta keep working on it, really. So, that's how it happens. I like a challenge, though, so... Challenge accepted. A little bit closer. Uh, it's kind of mirrored because of the camera, but I don't know if it is, but it's what it is. So that's really my Pokemon card collection. I have more, but I wanted to show you the one I currently use. Maybe I'll show you that other one some other day. But um, make sure to comment, like, subscribe, and for more of these crazy videos. And you'll definitely get more. And this is a video for Sunday because I said in another video that um I am going to take Monday off because I don't feel comfortable uploading on Monday because of 9-11. So this counts as the video for that day and 
you'll probably see me with another video on Tuesday for sure. So I hope to see you again and don't forget all that other stuff I said. So this is Slater727 signing out, aka Dylan. Bye-bye.